Hey, welcome back to Random Rick Reviews. Today we're going to do uh, some pack openings of the Epic Battles trading card game. You know, these packs are booster packs, come with 10 cards. This is a good game. Uh, it was only sold like in Blockbuster for some reason. It was a fighting game, card game, like had Tekken, Street Fighter, and Mortal Kombat. It played pretty fun. It felt like a, like a good fighting game back and forth. Unfortunately, it was marketed bad and... UFS somehow survived, and that game was not a good game at all. But got some booster packs, pretty cheap. So I'm gonna pop them open, see what we get. All right, got a carry card. Ling Zhao. So I'm going to do, when you play a block, put it at the bottom of your deck instead of discarding it. At the start of your discard, shuffle the top two cards of your discard pile into your deck. So in this game, your deck is your life. So she has like life gain. You got a high attack, which will um, combo in. A punch will combo in. So high attack throw. So you need a throw to follow that. Also has events, kind of like trap cards in Yu-Gi-Oh! that you put face down on the start of your turn. Another character card, Julia Chang. When you hit a throw, you may pay one energy. You get energy by, by just playing attacks. To so knock down your rival, when you do 10 or more damage with a punch, look at your rival's hand and choose a card. And then you discard it. That's not bad. And then, uh, so I guess the anatomy card is like, here's the type of attack it is. It's high attack punch. You need a slam to combo into it. So you can play a slam card after this. Does 10 damage. It costs one to play, one energy. And so if you do block it, they'll still take one chipping damage. And another character. Oh, that's cool. Uh, Brian Fury. Your rival can discard only one card from your energy pile per turn. At the start of battle, you may pay two energy to search your discard pile for an attack and put it into your oh, discard pile, put it in your energy pile. Okay, so stuff can trigger in your energy pile. Yeah, Ruth Irvin's Gatling Kicks. And there's a block. So this block is put the top two cards of your discard pile at the bottom of your deck. So this will go in her deck. Some more life gain. And handstand kick. Alright, not bad. Got three characters in that. That's pretty cool. And uh, it's always a Brian Fury fan. See what we get in the second pack here. We have high attack. Uh, Christy Monteros, Dosoy, Dosoy. I don't know what this is. Junpachi Mashimi. Foil. The thing say. All right. And blah blah blah. Got a character card. Wang Jinri. When you chip cards, so that's if you block and take chip damage. Put them at the bottom of your deck instead of your discard pile. When you flip an event, shuffle the top four cards of your discard pile into your deck. So, the life gain character. High attack punch. And a high block. Your rival's next attack does minus four damage. Like you can put those over there. Hmm. 
Cobra Sword, one play, shuffle your energy pile into your deck. Yeah, it's kind of rough. Another event. Another character. Yoshimitsu. Your weapons have a printing cost of zero. Your weapons that have a printing cost of zero are unblockable. Your rival must discard a card from his hand before playing a weapon, otherwise, that attack does zero damage. That, that could be very annoying. And I attack punch. Um, I don't know. Did we get any weapon cards? I don't know. Didn't see any. Yeah. Like this weapon card cost two, so it would not work with Yoshimitsu's effect. Anyway, so there is some Epic Battles TCG cards for the Tekken series. I believe Tekken was the last series he did. So it was Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat, and Tekken. But it's a good game. Plays quick. Epic Battles. And we have another Game Informer magazine. Game Informer. This is a magazine uh, made by GameStop. It's always kind of sucked. I picked these up for like 10 cents just to go through them a couple years back. This is, looks like it's from 2012. It's an Army of Two video game. On the cover. Sleeping Dogs, that was a pretty good game. Oh, unveiled Fortnite. Was that long ago? Okay. Two hot downloadable games on the horizon. Alright. Alright. The Wrath of the Dead Rabbit. Here, tablet, Nexus 7, Portal 2 turret. Damage Ink game. The co op issue, alright. I played Army of Two, it's, it's an okay game, it feels very budgety. Thirty co-op games of all time. Hmm. Left for Dead. And, I don't know. Contra. Sure. I'm gonna count Rock Band. Halo. NBA Jam, I guess. Diablo 2. Warcraft. Borderlands. Okay, I'll give you Borderlands and Gears. Lego Star Wars. Battlefield 2. I guess so. Course Team Fortress, Crackdown, Double Dragon, yeah, Rainbow Six Vegas. It's a shame what Rainbow Six has became. We really should go back to the, whole, the Vegas um, engine. Classic Gauntlet, Saints Row, uh, Dark Alliance. Uh, I would say Dark Alliance 1 is more fun than 2. Smash TV, yep, Gunstar Heroes, House of the Dead 2, it's a great game, Streets of Rage, those are always fun, RE5, 
Uh, Boiling fuel's coming out. Aliens Colonel Marines has failed. Rainbow Six Patriots. That's the game we want, not what we got. Far Cry, Transformers, Fall of Cybertron. It's actually pretty good. It's uh, the one I think it is. Black Ops 2. Still probably the best Call of Duty online multiplayer. Uh, Skylanders. And we have Dishonored. People liked. Crisis 3. Hawking. It's a very good free game. On a, well, it's not on PC anymore. It's only on Xbox um, One right now. I haven't logged in in a while. It might be gone. Uh, let's see here. Project P100. Never played it. Or Afterglow. Sports game. Soccer. Soccer. The King Story. Kingdom Hearts. 3D. Dream Drop. Uh, it has some ratings. Yeah. Sleeping Dog 7.75. Skyrim at 8. All right. That probably should be higher. Tony Hawk 7.5. The last story. I don't know if I've played that or not. I can't remember. So I can't remember. Probably not that good. Games here. There's a review archive. Secret of Mana, old school. Alright, there's a Game Informer from 2012. Alright, I think we're throwing a, a WWE card death. So we do a little epic battles opening. I haven't done one of these in a while. Shuffle these up. Uh, different sets. They don't shuffle very well because they're actual trading cards. Alright. Same as always. Six cards. Who do we got? We have Dusty Rhodes, Junkyard Dog, Dusty Rhodes again, Rocky Johnson, Captain Lou Albano, and Junkyard Dog. Hmm. All right. One, two, three. Dusty Rhodes. See you, Dusty. <laughs> 